Hey everyone, if you're a football fan, you've come to the right place. Today, I'm diving into the intense match between India and Qatar in the FIFA World Cup 2026 qualifiers. Let's break it down. The stage was set at the Jasim bin Hamad Stadium in Doha, Qatar. It was a decisive game for India, needing a win to keep their World Cup dreams alive. The match started strong for India, with Lalianzwala Changte finding the back of the net in the first half. Boy, was that a moment. The excitement in the air was palpable as India took the lead. But football, as we know, is full of surprises. The reigning Asian champions, Qatar, were not going down without a fight. They pushed back hard, and it wasn't until the 83rd minute that Ahmed Al-Rawi turned the game on its head with a crucial goal for Qatar. The tension was sky high, as India now had only minutes to respond. In those final nail-biting minutes, India poured everything they had into the game. They fought valiantly for an equaliser, creating chances and keeping us on the edge of our seats. But despite their best efforts, the equaliser remained elusive. The match ended too, one in favour of Qatar. India finished third in Group A with just one win from six matches. A tough pill to swallow for the team and fans alike. Kuwait, on the other hand, secured their spot in the next round with a 1-0 victory over Afghanistan. This match was more than just scores and statistics. It was a display of determination, skill and passion. India may not have come out on top, but their fighting spirit was a win in the hearts of football enthusiasts. That's all from me today. Whether you're a die-hard football fan or just love a good match, this game had moments that will be talked about for a long time. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you in the next one. Keep playing, keep dreaming.